Welcome to Act of Video 6A, Making Bookings. So in this, in this short video we are going to um, look at how to create bookings. Now there's a couple of ways to do it. You can click the button here, Make a Booking, and when you click that, this screen comes up and you have to enter in the title, the booking type, and you have to obviously invite the people who are going to the booking. But what I like to do, because it's slightly faster, you can also go to add new bookings in here from the tab, but I like to actually go to the person who's coming to the booking. So that's either the tutor or the student. So in this case I'm going to go to the student who's doing it, and it's Isabella. And when I click the student Isabella, if you look across the top, I've got a button here that says create new booking. Now the good thing about this is that it automatically adds Isabella as an invitee. That's something you don't have to do. And it puts her name up here in the title. So I'm just going to edit this, take the dash out. It's going to be a computer booking, computer tuition. I'm going to make it recurring. It's going to be at 3 o 3.30. It's for 60 minutes. You type in a number of minutes with the duration. The start date is going to be on uh, Saturday and the finish date is going to be in September and it's going to be on the last Saturday. So I've got the invitee. Because it's computer tuition all I need to do is invite the student. I've got what kind of booking it is. I've got the time right, the duration, the start date and the end date. Create booking. When you click create booking you will you must, oh, I didn't select frequency, thank you. It's every week on Saturday. Now click Create Booking. Now these are the bookings that I've just created. Now these are a series of bookings, and up the top here you can see you can delete a series, but you can also check, click individual bookings and change those bookings themselves. So in the future, let's say Saturday the 12th of September, the mum might ring up and say she's sick today, can we come in on Monday? You can click this booking and change the day to Monday. So there are a series of bookings, but they can be changed individually. I'm going to create another booking, so I'm going to go to Students. This one is, this time it's for Jay. This is going to be a one-to-one -one booking. So I click the Student, click Create Booking, this gives me the title already and it already invites Jay to the booking. It's going to be one to one, which is down here. It's also going to be on a Saturday. It's going to be at 8 a.m. It's 60 minutes. Um, recurring and it's weekly and it's finishing in September on the last day as well. Okay so this is a one-to-one -one booking the students invited that means when the booking is completed the student will lose the hour but unless the tutor is involved are invited now see I'm looking for a tutor called Joel that it says none there that's because I got care checked I must check staff and then look for the tutor. If I was looking for a student, I click student. If I was looking for a parent, I click carer. So now Joel is invited to the booking as well as the student, Jay. This means that when this booking is completed, Joel will be allocated the hour so he can get paid and Jay will lose the hour, it will come off her credit hours. And there's the series of bookings. That's the end of this short video.